Yeah, so my name is James Mattis. I'm the, one of the founders of World Champ Tech. Uh, we've developed a family of apps for both the Pebble and the iOS um, iPhone. So our first app is Bike Plus, um, or also Bike More. And uh, we also have a version for running, Run Plus, you know, hiking and walking, and Hike Plus and Walk Plus. And uh, they, it's a each has an iOS app, and then it can you know the Pebble app that they talk with, so you can get your data on your wrist while you have your phone here in your pocket or. You know, some people might have their phone in their handlebars, I guess, too, for biking, but um, we're trying to replace that now with the little pebble bike mount because I think it's a more convenient place to get your data while you're actually riding. So the big news today, obviously, is that we, we just launched Kickstarter at, at 12 noon Pacific time. Um, Kickstarter to build these little bicycle mounts for uh, the Pebble Watch. So this is one of the mounts with a pebble integrated in it. You can see this thing looks so slick, right? You know, it's so tightly integrated that you can barely tell where the pebble ends and the mount starts. Here's one of the mounts without the pedal in it. And I think one of the exciting things about this is when you look at the features that are kind of offered on the Pebble and with what we're able to do on our iOS app, and you compare to the equivalent features on other GPS apps, we're, you know, the price for this system is about half of what you might see for a comparable GPS device. So, you know, you could Go spend $200 and get this whole kit, or spend $400 or $500 and get something that kind of doesn't do as much. When did your passion for competition and cycling meet with your passion for like engineering and building? I think uh, you know it was really around the, uh, the release of the iPhone when I recognized that like you could now have this fully programmable computer that you could start to do cool stuff with. Right? And there wasn't anything prior to that that really allowed you to do this. Um, you know, and then obviously the release of the Pebble was kind of the second step in that to kind of go, okay, and now it's super convenient too, right? Um, it's, it's, yeah, it's obviously it's easy to carry the phone in your pocket, but you want to be reaching out to look at it all the time, right? You want something that's going to show the data somewhere else and give you the ability to control everything that's going on with your phone, right? And that's what the Pebble allows you to do. So, you know, the, obviously I've been riding around now doing a lot of testing with the Pebble as a wristwatch, but having it here on your wrist is pretty good, but if you could put it on your handlebars, it's a lot better of a design to put on your handlebars, right? It's like you always want to try to take advantage of whatever opportunities are there and do them, yeah. you know? And doing athletics when I was, you know, I'm, I'm kind of basically retired from cycling and it was like I had this opportunity to do it at a really high level. It's like take the advantage while you can, you're not going to do it when you're 80, you know? So I went and did this and like, you know, the technology's finally arrived where something like the Pebble really works, you know? And it's like, okay, now's the time to do it. In fact, a lot of what we're doing with Bike Plus kind of came from my experience riding, where I'd be riding around, and I used various bike computers, one type or another, and you're always thinking like, this is okay, but God, if I had my own like fully programmable computer, what could I do with it? And it's right. like, now I've got it. My <laughs> own fully programmable computer that sits on my handlebars, and I can program it in sort of a myriad of different ways and do all sorts of cool stuff. You know, whether you're a writer or someone doing film or photography, or an engineer, you know, there's just this joy of actually building something and bringing this idea out of your head and getting it into reality. And you know, whether it's on the computer screen or your smartphone screen or the Pebble screen or even this little, uh, you know, small plastic part to kind of enable the Pebble to mount with on your bike, right? Just it's just very emotionally uplifting when you finally see that project come to fruition, come to life. You know, I think it's why anyone who creates stuff is kind of in the game at all, you know.